Today we're going to be making our own Ming Dynasty inspired porcelain vase. We're going to be using blue colored pencils, a sharpie, liquid watercolors, and some heavy stock paper. Use a piece of blank paper, fold it in half, and make half of your vase. This way you have a symmetrical vase. So if you use a marker or a pencil and make half of it, then when you go to cut it out and open it up, it will be the full vase and it will be completely symmetrical. If you want to add handles afterwards, you can totally do that. Just make sure you erase your pencil lines. Using the visuals provided, decorate your vase to be look as authentic as you possibly can, adding flowers, dragons, and any type of other Chinese symbols that we talked about in class. When you're painting your background, you are going to be picking the warm or the cool colors. The warm colors are red, orange, and yellow, and the cool colors are blue, green, and purple. You're going to be using liquid watercolor for this, so you'll need a watercolor brush, liquid water paints, and a water cup. If you want your colors to look lighter, you just simply dip your brush in a little bit of water and it will get lighter. Paint your background however you would like. You could do a pattern or you could make it a little bit more random. It is completely up to you, just as long as it is totally filled up. While this is drying, if you have not finished your vase, you need to finish that by adding color pencil and even Sharpie if you'd like. Your vase should be also filled up and it should resemble the Ming Dynasty porcelain vases that we looked at in class. Once your watercolor is dry, you're going to cut out your vase and glue it onto your background. Then we're going to move on to the next step. We are going to use black liquid watercolor to show the branches coming out of our vases. After you're done with this step, then you are complete with this project. Great job friends, you created your own Ming Dynasty porcelain vase.